presenting Soniac. I'm Soniac from Grenoble, Alps, France. Come in, I'm going to present it, my workshop and my sculptures. Soniac, Grenoble. Hello. So, this one is my last one. This one is uh, my clown uh, skater. She's, um, I love her. Um, she's sewing vine set and paper, and you can see the craft. I will let the craft. And uh, <clears throat> I'm very impatient to finish her because she's almost finished. The volume is quite finished. I'm just going to sculpt a little bit this part here and then paint it and I want to paint it because as it is a circus theme I want to have flashy colors on the dress only the dress and the, um, the hair and of course the nose well so that's it this wood comes from Tain Hermitage I go to Tain Hermitage to take my woods my set uh, I have here a very beautiful one, natural, I only cut it, it's very beautiful, you can see the movement, uh, I love it, and um, it's great. I go to, this. we have regions with wine here in France, of course, good wines, Dans Hermitage, Saint Joseph, Bourgogne, and we also have the Savoie, but Savoie is no good because the Sep uh, de Vigna, you know, like this. And uh, in Tanya Minaj, they are like this, you have a lot of movement, it's very great. I love it. So here you have that little sculpture I did oof, a long time ago. And uh, this sculpture, I really like it because it's my dream for the future, <laughs> making movement in my sculpture. Here is supposed to be the TV, I have it. He's watching TV and he has his remote control. My creations evolved quite a lot since the beginning in 2003. The beginning, my creations were very colored and very influenced by Latin America where I lived almost 10 years. And then a little bit of an evolution, I went to Burkina Faso in 2008 eight I think and I uh, was very influenced by the woman the colors the clothes and um, some other creation like those before love couple that I did in 2006 and I used more the craft paper and I started uh, making patterns instead of uh, using all colors. So you have here uh, toujours prête à tomber, which means always ready to fall down. Uh, I consider it my masterpiece and um, I sold it. This sculpture in vine and um, paper and particular craft that I like a lot are the last I do now. I love to represent movements. I work a lot on it. And I love also to represent the contradiction of the human people, uh, the contradiction that are represented by the mediums, the tortured wood and uh, the beautiful little faces, a little bit smiling because they want to hide to the people what is inside of their head, their moods and sufferings. Well, that's it. I wish to meet you soon and uh, take care. Bye.